What's up, y'all? So, I don't know if y'all know what this is. I don't know if um, y'all have ever used one, but this one's been around for years. It's getting a little, a little worn out, and uh, there's no weights on it. I'm, I'm sure I robbed the weights off of it for jugging or something, but it's time to make a new one. But this here is the same yet. I used to go through the creeks, catch creek suckers, brims, whatever was in them holes. So today, if it don't rain on me, but today we're going to make a new sink net. So we've had multiple two-man stands, and with the two-man stands came uh, the camouflage burlap front that wraps around the stand. Well, we got a few extras, and this one's got some holes in it, but this is what I'm going to use right here. This is what I'm going to use. It's already got the strings on there I can tie to the sticks with, and then I'll run my weights along there, and uh, yeah, that's going to work great. That's going to work great. And for my handles, I'm going to use some good old backer sticks. Here comes the rain. I'm going to use some good old backer sticks here. Um, so yeah, y'all hang in there. I ain't going to take long. I'm just going to tie this together. And I'm going to go back and use some masonry twine stuff and lace the weights to the, um, the burlap there. That way they didn't just, you know, hang. They'll have a gap in them. They can catch sticks. So just keep it all... Keep it all, you know, together. get the point pretty much just like that I'm using the end of a little chicken skewer stick here to poke through the, the end of these weights so that way I can tie the weights into the middle and I got these tied in yeah like I said you're gonna want some some sticks like this, you get you a, a backer sack, burlap sack of any kind. It don't have to be this. It could be any burlap sack. Something that the water can go through. That way it's not pulling it back. You can go to Walmart or anywhere and get you some of this. Get you some, some egg weights and tie them.
well down. Don't look like that's gonna work. <laughs> Time to re-improve. Did you just tear it? Yeah, the water tore it. I figured, you know, since it's weatherproof and it sets out in the sun and rain. Yeah. That's all right. I got another net at the house that's that I know works. ticked off about the situation earlier so I figured that net would have been a little bit stronger than what it was considering it's a you know it's a net that sits outside on a deer stand through the hot sun and the rain and everything like that that old net that I showed y'all at the beginning of the video I think that's gonna be my new saying now I'm yeah, I'm just, yeah, I'm doing this all over again. You heard it, so whatever. But uh, right now we're, me and my buddy Drew, we went to the creek and caught a few fish out of the creek. But now we're going to fish some, uh, we're going to fish some ponds. minutes later got the new same net here we're about to go try it out I know this one looks a lot weaker but I mean it actually seems pretty strong but we'll see what happens I'll see you at the creek
there's a crawfish right there. Oh hell yeah. Told you bro. This is what we used There's to another crawfish, look at that one. Yeah, this is what me and Papa and Daniel used to do. So one, two, look at that thing, dude. Three, look, he's got a baby feature. He grew that one back. He must have broke it off at one time. There's a baby one. Yeah, yeah. I told you it freaking worked. So, three crawdads and a bag on. Or two crawdads and three fruit minners. Really? Dang yeah, on. A baby, a baby, uh... Golly, look at all them crawdads, dude. Yeah, dude. Look, baby one, though. Hell free with them. Yeah, yeah. Bunch of crawdads. Look at that. Get pinch my knees. Grab, grab that little one. I don't know, bro. Kind of sketchy. You just gotta grab them. Oh yep. yeah, you can you feel their them. shells hard. Yep. Like. Never seen one of these before. I don't know what it is. We don't know. Don't know. I don't know what it is. It's not a creek, a creek sucker. I don't know. His body's like clear looking like mm -hmm. Yeah, I bet
gonna go ahead and close this video. Appreciate y'all uh, checking out this video. Getting ready for deer season, and all the critters are gonna be gonna be out this year. Doves is coming up first. Dove season is coming up first, and then bow season next. But got my bow sighted in. And Thomas got his new crossbow sighted in. But been a pretty eventful weekend. I turned out kind of shitty at first because I thought, you know, I wasn't gonna be able to make a new seine net, but. That other net worked good enough. We caught some fish with it. And I'm probably going to make another one. So, All right, y'all. Well, y'all take care. And uh, thanks for tuning in with Carolina Fantasy. And I'll catch y'all next time. Peace.